What's going guys, Zenos here and today in this video, I'm here to present you guys the first impressions on the global launch of Magatsu Warhead. Yes, you heard me right. This game is now available for download in your cell phone devices and start enjoying this game right away. Let's see what are the gameplay features that this game has to offer to us. And in the first glance, this online JRPG game has so many things to offer guys. Wow, just look into the lobby screen and it actually is pretty much overwhelming right off the bat. But first of all, let's see what sort of battle mechanics we can actually enjoy in this game all right so let's get this started okay well there is only one character the main gacha feature that this game is going to provide to us is going to be the weapons yes you got to get like different varieties types of weapons and with those weapons you will be able to unleash various sorts of skills and lots of damages on the opponents and blah 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 okay so that's that guys okay let's skip this right over here i really hate cutscenes <laughs> Let's just move ahead, okay? And let's uh, let's just skip the story right now. So right over here, guys, it's too easy, guys. All right, all you can do is just auto it. Yes, you heard me right. You might actually be wondering, like, where should I go next? All right, just click on the uh, top left corner, this uh, command right over there, which is going to auto your main character right over here, guys. And he's just going to go next to the uh, mission points or whatever that is, okay? Like, let's say these targets, and we got to defeat that guy right over there. You can even auto the battle right of here or you can just manual it and just click on the skills that is available or ready to be used okay and he can actually unleash various sorts of skills or provide some really good type of buff to himself yes weapons are the ones that actually provides various, various types of skills in this game so well let's keep on moving on guys okay weapons are pretty much the main stuff in this game okay so Keep that in mind. The best weapon that you can get in this game is going to be SSR type of weapon. And uh, per every quest or per, per every story mode, there are going to be like uh, multiple battles involved. Okay. So right away, guys, let's try to use this tap slash right over there. Wow, that's really cool, isn't it? And this time, let's try to use the double slash right over there. And let's try to use the RS Unleashed. Okay. He's actually going to provide a little bit of buff to himself. But... The opponent is already dead okay so you might be asking like oh my god hey genos you got some really good allies right over there is that your units i would say no those are the other players right over there it's like a massive mmorpg game right out there okay so i'm actually gonna team up with them like let's say gato right over here i'm gonna team up with him or her and let's try to just you know like beat them up together so well you know like it's really good uh, to ally with the other players out there guys and well i can actually even you know like interact with them like let's say like this kind of icon right over here the teddy bear icon and wall like this kind of thing right over there <laughs> okay that's really good man i just like it i just really like it and uh, if you can actually join your attacks or join your forces with the other players out there you can even trigger better combos yes a lot of combos right over there so that you can increase uh, your damage output on the opponents or you know like you can just be more stylish right over there guys okay i just like that <laughs> so let's keep on moving on guys let's keep on moving on right over there let's keep this uh, stuff right over here and let's keep moving forward Man, this game seems to be really, really cool in my opinion. I mean, like, the graphics may not be really that super amazing, but it kind of reminds me of the Final Fantasy series. And sometimes there is a little bit of glitch going on while I'm actually playing this game. I really don't know why. What's up with that? <laughs> but still, man, the gameplay features, the gameplay mechanics is a little bit addictive in my opinion. It's really good. I mean, like, there's so many things happening around. You can actually see all the stats, all the buffs, all the uh, debuffs that is actually applicable right now. And there is, like, combo stuff right over there as well. And so many other th things, guys. And I actually just managed to do the overkill on the opponent. Wow. <laughs> Man, I still gotta uh, get a very good grasp on this game. Uh, but, well, for now, I'm pretty much happy with what I've learned so far. Okay? And I'm actually telling it to you guys. So that's get that, guys. Quest is cleared now. So you gotta keep on clearing out the quest in order to keep on uh, progressing through the story mode. And blah, blah, blah. And so many other things on. Okay? So that you can keep on improving your unit and many other things out there guys okay so let's skip right over here there's a lot of cutscenes right over there and let's try to look into my character how i can actually improve or enhance my character i can see right over here so let's go into the equipment section all you need to do is just click on the auto equip button right over there guys this is one of the best button that i've actually seen in this game <laughs> Auto equip and everything is gonna be right over there. I actually managed to get this SSR weapon right off the bat because the first mode, I mean, like the first summon, is actually going to guarantee you guys a SSR weapon right off the bat. So it's really good, guys. Which I think is actually going to negate or actually gonna make it. Um, unnecessary to reroll in this game okay why are you supposed to reroll in this game when you are actually going to get ssr weapon right off the bat so i really don't see any 
uh, point at all on that one okay so that's that guys uh, you can weapon like multiple weapons right over there which are actually needed in order to land like various types of skill sets that this uh, hero unit right over here has okay so let's go into the skill info right over here first it's gonna be the slash 2 uh, next thing is gonna be the Ares unleashed uh, tap slash and double slash and so many other things right over there guys inflicts 125% of physical damage to the enemy units uh, in 30 seconds increase your physical attack by 30% the recasting time of a skill reduced by 30% well it's a little bit like you know very complicated for now uh you can see right over here that my background uh, screen is a little bit glitched right over there i really don't know what's happening uh, it's a negative point from my side not really that good is it uh, but well when i go into the lobby section everything is fixed okay so that's really good out there you can actually check out the missions where you can actually take a lot of rewards and the main thing that i really want to tell to you guys is going to be the gift yes when you are going to start a new account what are the previous rewards or let's say the main uh, starter rewards that you are gonna get right off the bat okay which might actually give you a really good boost uh ahead okay so let's uh, accept this gem right over there Let's accept this gacha ticket right over there as well. Another gacha ticket I have. Uh, this gold right over here. That's good. 100,000 gold. Uh, that's going to be 10 gems. And I've got a SSR class equipment ticket. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> look at that man look at that pre-order past 2000 uh gift right over there guys okay uh that's that and uh well that's gonna be uh 20 free gems right over there and i think it's time to go into the gacha in order to use those uh stuffs that i just managed to get right now right so let's go into the gacha summons and now it's time to do the gacha but first of all you might actually want to know what's the rate in this game what are the rates of getting the ssr weapons well let's look into that one guys and i think it's pretty cool right over here guys because the rates are are pretty awesome let's look into the drop rate right over here guys ssr weapon will drop at four percent chance i think that's real good four percent come on that's a lot man sr weapon it's a 30 percent chance and rare weapon it's a 66 percent chance so i think it's really good guys there are tons of SSR weapons that you can actually choose you can actually get uh in this game which will definitely keep on improving the uh, stats and performance of your units okay so that's that guys okay uh the one thing that i'm actually uh, you know like uh, searching right now is gonna be that ticket where the hell is that ticket okay yeah yeah it's the ticket section is right over here guys okay uh five star ssr gacha ticket okay let's try to use it right over here okay spin gacha okay <laughs> let's do it man i got that okay the gacha summon screen the animation screen really looks like that one it kind of looks really cool right over there Pretty awesome, pretty awesome. Okay, there we go. That's a multi summon, I guess. <laughs> All right, come on, man. That's a gold chest. Oh, why? Okay, okay, okay. There we go. I think that's gonna be really good stuff right over there. So I gotta click on this one, touch the screen, and it's gonna come out. And let's see what are the weapons that I managed to get. SSR Lethality Earrings, guys. SR Meteor Great Sword. Uh, rare Mira Googles. Okay, there we go. Rare Hunter Googles. All right. I think that's gonna be some special weapon right over there. That's gonna be SSR Rebellion Raider Hoods. Man, I'm already bombarded with so many SSR weapons right away. Lightning Earrings. Uh, Peace Greaves. Okay, that's good. A uh, Blaze Boots. All right, that's nice. And SR Tornado Wristband. Okay, that's awesome, man. That's awesome. This was a really good uh, gacha right over there, guys. I actually managed to get two SSR uh, equipments, and that's real good, isn't it? <laughs> okay, let's try to get this one as well. Okay, let's spin the gacha right over here, guys. Okay, I think I can skip now. Okay, no more waifus right over there. Just one rare uh, item right over there. What the hell was that? Okay, uh, spin for one time. Uh, I think this is the SSR ticket. Yes, yes. Uh, spin gacha okay this is the time to get the ssr ticket i mean like ssr weapon and it's going to give me a ssr what do you call this lethality bracelets okay so well i will be equipping that to my hero unit a little bit later on okay so that's that guys that was a uh limited or let's say you know like ticket type gacha uh that i actually managed to get from the uh you know like the mailbox okay is there something else that i can actually capitalize on seems to be nothing okay so well that is it uh, let's go into the weapon section right over here. Uh, this is the paid uh, rubies or whatever that is you may call it. Uh, right over here guys I think I can do this right over here the multiple gacha right over here there's a 4% chance for me to get an SSR weapon uh, let's see if I can actually get it okay so right over here guys whoa whoa whoa, whoa. this is so sad <laughs> so many rares only one SR what the hell man my luck just get duped right over there 
Okay, that's really sad, isn't it? And there's like equipment gadgets right over here as well. And I think I can actually see the details right over here. I think it's gonna also gonna be 4% chance to get SSR equipments. Let's uh, look into that one. Okay, right over here, the drop rate. Yes, 5% chance. Oh, sorry. For the equipment gacha, this is a 5% chance for SSR, a 30% chance for SR, web, uh, SR equipments, and for the rare equipments, there's a 65% chance of drop rate. So cool, man. So cool. Not bad. Not bad, actually. Uh, that's good. Okay, now let's get back and well, not right now, not right now. Let's go into my character and let's try to do some auto equipment right over here so that, you know, like my character is going to be really good. Just look at that, man. Just right away, his appearance just changed so good, man. And I actually managed to give him some really good SSR you know, like stuffs right over here like you know there's uh, items right over here and definitely he's going to have much easier time in dealing with the opponents now okay so that's that guys i'm really really happy and class select yes you can actually even select the class of what type of class you are actually going to um, go with uh wizard is it going to be wizard is it going to be knight or is it going to be like something else or whatsoever okay uh, i think for me uh, i think everybody knows that what i really love it's going to be wizard okay but let's see what are the other classes that is available that's a knight that's going to be your priest i think priest is uh, specialized on providing the heals and supports to the uh, other allies uh, as you guys actually saw a while ago um, you know like it's not a solo fight okay I can actually team up with the other players right out there without any problem at all in order to do some like you know um, I mean, like, we can join forces to defeat the opponents, right? In that case, definitely Priest is going to be a really great help. This is going to be Hunter. I think he's going to be very agile. Next thing is going to be Gunner unit right over here. So he can actually have a really good... Uh you know, like ranged attacks and blah blah blah, warrior in it, and uh, this wizard. Okay, I will be going with wizard. I mean, like, I really love wizard, so why not? Oh shit, I gotta complete the tutorial before you can participate in the class qualifier quest. Okay, 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 okay. Not right now. Hey, <laughs> so later on, later on, I will be doing that later on. And character make. Yes, you can go into the character make in order to like provide some really good design to your character, like let's say headgear, uh, upper body, lower body, and blah blah blah. Okay, so well, that's that, guys. Uh, nothing much more right over there. And in the mission, it seems that like I actually managed to fulfill some of the missions right over here with which I actually managed to get some really good rewards right away okay so that's that guys I can I can actually go into the force right over here in order to go into the soul tree and well uh, there is actually a tutorial going on around are you want to skip the event yes why not well this is definitely a board system which will definitely provide me extra stat boost and blah 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 and whatsoever okay so right over here guys um, okay orbs view orbs okay that's that guys that's it just try to like improve the board and try to get the extra stats, okay? It's a little bit complicated right now. Definitely, I will be trying to come with the guide video on this kind of stuffs. I really don't want to cover up all those kind of things in this, you know, like first impression video right over here. So these are the, all the equipments that I gotta have. Uh, enhance, okay. If I want to enhance certain weapon, that would be this SSR uh, equipment right over here. Can I actually just like do it? Okay, yes, it's actually gonna cost you some currency right over here. So I think I can do it. So let's do it. Why not? Okay, right over there. There we go and keep on enhancing so that like their stats keeps on increasing and definitely it's going to provide a really good boost to your main hero unit right so i think i can lock this thing right over here equipment locked yes that's good increase the critical strength by 100 points okay that's good okay all right so let's get back and that's pretty much it wow <laughs> man there are so many glitches in this game that's what i gotta say to you guys there are so many glitches in this game let's look into the pay to win feature right over here guys this girl this cute girl is trying to grab a lot of cash from my pocket <laughs> okay let's look into the gems right over here wow that's a lot of cash right over there oh my god what the hell no i'm not going to pay so many money for so little things right out there guys wow this game is really pay to win <laughs> It's very, very expensive, guys. Okay, one time limited, 50% uh, SSR capsule weapon gift pack and blah, blah, blah. So these are the things that you can get. Uh, if I want to purchase, uh, it's going to be costing about nearly, uh, how many, like $20? I think, yes, $20 or $25. 20 to 25 dollars okay so that's that guys uh, item i can actually purchase the items as well with the help of the james right over here exp booster sp booster okay uh, but i gotta have the paid jam in order to get this one what the hell oh man that's so bad pass ticket ticket for the training level i can actually get this one right over here patches why not let's get one okay so there we go guys there are so many other things that you can get from the shop which is definitely going to uh, improve the account progression of your main account okay so that's it uh, let's go into the menu let's see what are the things profile ranking items option blah 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 and whatsoever you can actually bind your account to your i think email yeah you can do that <laughs> all right all right all right 
Uh, what are the other things that I think we actually already visited to the exchange section? Oh, no, 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 no uh, Treasure exchange. Yes. So for the various uh, sort of like uh, stuff right out there in the game We it seems that like we can actually exchange those kind of things like let's say this one right over here called the weapon gacha coin Obtain a weapon ticket in the weapon gacha coin exchange and we with this we can actually get some really cool stuff right over here like class SSR 100% SSR weapon ticket and blah 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 uh, limited gacha coin exchange right over here is also present right over there guys and so many more guys okay uh well this game is totally overloaded right now definitely i will not be uh able to complete all those kind of tutorials right over here in this main first impression video well in summary guys i'm really happy with this game this game has really good battle features it's not really that heavy and it's not really that light either okay it has a lot of features that i can actually uh keep on enjoying uh very now and then and it's, it has a really big potential to become a mainstream game rather than just ending up as a side game okay it has so many things that you can actually exploit i mean like being able to team up with other players out there online it's something really massive guys i mean like other mmorpg game is not going to provide you guys this feature right off the bat because you have you got to do the solo battles right but in this game right off the bat when you start a new account you are going to team up with the other players how good that really sounds i would say it's definitely awesome guys so definitely uh, the interaction with the other player is definitely going to make this game like one of the best out there i guess okay so let's see how far this game will really go and definitely i will be coming coming up with other tutorial videos in this game as well let's see over it anyways that is it for today guys i would really love to know your insights feedbacks and whatever that you have got with this game and please don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button to keep on using the content on my channel see you guys in the next video